Are you good at putting up barriers? It's <laughs> most important in the skincare world, and the moisture barrier is the outermost layer of the skin. Here to tell us more about these layers and how to make sure we can restore them is licensed esthetician Kristen Michael. Hello. Kristen, thanks so much for being here. Happy New Year. You have a beautiful barrier. Oh, You're thank always you. glowing. Thank you. Yours thank is intact. You. Okay, I'll, apparently. I'll take that. I'll, we're, we are an oily girl, <laughs> so I think the moisture barrier is going to be there 24 7. Yes. <laughs> I mean, that moisture barrier, pretend like it's your bodyguard of your skin. It really is important. It kind of it protects, it keeps stuff out, but it holds moisture and it keeps out that like environmental crud, all the aggravators that can come in and irritate the skin. And this is the time of year where we need it the most. Yes. Because yes. That, is that why our skin is dry or drying out? Like that burning, drying, flaking, crackling, all that stuff is a disrupted moisture barrier. Okay. Who knew? I didn't even know that was a term. So yes, I learned something it is. new today. And so I just have my three quick, you know, tips. I try not to bring too many because we run out of time if I try to talk too much. But You're a wealth of knowledge. Yes, I had so much to say. Um, okay, always start by looking for a product. This is actually easy because it says medical barrier cream. Boom. So try looking for a product that has the word barrier on it. They're always going to be really thick. Okay. So you know how you mentioned oily skin? You might feel like this is so thick. Oh, this is, no, this is, I want this on my body every night after I get out of the I mean, shower. yeah, yeah, exactly. Ooh, okay. Medical so grade is, stuff doesn't always have that great smell, but. Yeah, but it doesn't smell terribly. Yet. Yes. I did have to do the smell test. Yes, it I mean. It doesn't smell bad. Okay, so with this, how often should we be putting on Well, that depends on how, how messed up our, our and disrupted our barrier is, but I okay. mean, daily is fine. This says um, apply to clean skin daily. Okay, I can so, do this daily. Can yes. I do it twice a day when I wash in the morning and in the yeah, evening? Yeah, but don't get too crazy. Sometimes okay. less is more when you've got that disrupted barrier. Okay, less So, is yeah, so look for products that have the word barrier. Easy peasy. Moving on, well, before I move on too quickly, never underestimate the power of your ice rollers. These ice rollers are gay. Game changers, if, okay? Yes, if you're feeling kind of like crackly and, and hot all the time, like that hot burning sensation, these things are like just easy peasy. Mm -hmm. Put them over this product. That will actually great. push the product in better too. That's something and these aren't that, even cold. No, these aren't, they're not even out of the fridge, but they're still cold. You oh, know yeah, what I mean? This is nice. Because they're metal. Dreamy. Um, and also, speaking of don't underestimate, good old Aquaphor. You know, I Can't used to have wrong. a problem with Aquaphor, but now in my older <laughs> age, <laughs> I feel like, and the more research I've mm. done, Aquaphor is not terrible. You can do that skin slugging at night. Okay. If you're real, which I've had, I did a segment on where you basically sleep in Aquaphor. You would not do that every night. Okay. Don't ever. do that but every night, but be, it does help. Yes. When you're having just a real inflamed, your barrier is just all messed up. Okay. I tell my kids to do it sometimes. Okay, okay so last, it works for all ages. Yeah, especially, okay. yeah, because it gets kind of crackly. Bring out your humidifier too, let me throw that in. Okay. I want to say this. Did you do it? Because of you, I ordered a humidifier. It's, did it make a huge yes. difference? No wonder you look no so idea. good. I had no idea. It's like right by my bed. They say don't do that on the packaging. They say don't oh, put it right by your thank bed. Thank you for telling me that. Or I did by not the know wall, that. Okay. whatever. Okay. <laughs> we gonna do it anyway. I and told everybody to put it by their bed. <laughs> I put mine by the bed, and, cause that's what you told me. Yes. <laughs> and I put a little, I got a, um, sorry, I'm like derailing. Yeah, some like peppermint or I, something? Yes, yeah. I got an essential oil diffuser. Yes. And so it's not only working uh, for my face, but I put that's lavender why you're in there before you're glowing so well today. Thank you, oh, thank you, thank you. Okay, so but get that But speaking of glowing, this. so, and I wrote down these oils that I want you to, to pay attention to because okay. I didn't want to forget any, but okay. look for um, avocado oil, jojoba oil, sweet almond oil, sunflower, safflower, safflower. Those are the skin oils that will not clog your pores, but will give you that like re repair Repair. your barrier. And actually, like cause you want to think nourishment. Mm -hmm. You want to like, you damaged your skin barrier. You want to like build it back up. Like you got to really treat it with a Can lot I of try this kindness. Too? Yeah, kindness okay. and respect with those barriers. I feel like my whole, I'm going to show you oh. all the difference between my two sides after all of these and now don't be afraid because it has the word oils not all oils are Ooh. meant to are now gonna clog your skin smells ethereal yes okay now look at the moisture that barrier on my oil. left hand yes <laughs> and look look it doesn't exist exactly okay your these moisture are, barriers there it's just really intact i like it well my skin is glowing in st louis if you would like <laughs> to add some of these tips to take care of your moisture barrier this winter season you absolutely can if you're also looking for a new esthetician or maybe some products you can find my Kristen Michael's skincare line online and you can also book her. Her website is kristenmichael.com and you can show her some love on Facebook and on Instagram. I mean look at